Hello everyone, I am Paulo Lopez. I'm 27 years old. I was born in Brazil. So my first language is not English. That's why you're gonna notice my accent and some mistakes here and there. I have been living in America for almost three years and I'm happy for being in South Florida Bible College. So I got my degree in public relation in 2013. All right, so to introduce you to my testimony, I'd like to tell you about when I was 14. So I start to using drugs. I start with weed and then we go to cocaine, to LSD, ecstasy, cigarette, and so forth. So my life was party, girls, and drugs. Until my 19, when I was 19, I got invited to a camp, like a church camp in my hometown and my home church. So when I went there, I remember when I, on the Friday, I smoked about five cigarettes before going to the camp because I knew I couldn't do it over there. So there, I listened to the preacher saying something precious to my life. They say, God could do anything. I should just pray. So that night I prayed and I said, God, if you really have that much power, can you please take this desire of smoking away from me? Because I had asthma at the time and that was killing me even more than the drugs. I remember on the Sunday, I couldn't stand the smell of a cigarette. So God really delivered me from the addiction and with that, everything else, the cocaine, the weed, really changed my life. So it was 19 turning 20. When I understood that, I saw that only Jesus can bring the good joy, the truth joy, and he's the truth way, okay? And the truth life, of course. So I started my ministry in that. In my ministry, was to explain people that they live in illusion and that is a true way which is Jesus. So who was the first one? My old friend. I started to go into them to share the gospel, to share my testimony. And then I started my ministry going to the street, talk to the homeless, going to to some parties just to, to share the gospel. Yes, I did that. So we did also a small groups in my college. When I was studying back in college, I did a small group at my place. So I was so full of Jesus and the understanding me that I was living an illusion. Now I lived the truth life that I had to share it with someone. So when I was 24, God called me to the United States. And here I am. I also did a small group here in my English school. I also have a small group and house in here in my Brazilian church. I still serve in the Lord. And why did I choose to go to a Bible college? Because I understand as much knowledge I have about God, about the history of God, about the church, the history of the church, more useful I can be for his kingdom. So I'm happy for being South Florida Bible College because no, I know that here God is equipping me to do his work, to be a strong tool in his, in his hand. So after that, I have many dreams. Dreams to go to the field as a missionary. Dreams to maybe become a pastor. But I don't really know. I'm not completely sure what exactly God wants. What I know is he can and he will give me a lot of knowledge, directions. Going to show me the path throughout the South Florida Bible College. So I have high expectation for this first. It's only my first semester. My Four week studying here, but you already know God is gonna do huge things in my life and through my life. And it's a blessing for me, it's an opportunity, it's a privilege to be in another nation, studying another language about the same God that has been preaching since the, the beginning. And since Jesus, when He came, He died on the cross for us, everyone has shared. Everyone who received the gospel had to share. So and I have the opportunity of living in another nation, sharing the same love, the same gospel, the same truth, and I hope to do it until the end of my life. So God bless you guys. Thank you so much.